All right, well, it's a beautiful Wednesday morning, December 6th or 7th, I don't even know. But anyway, today I feel like uh, putting on my billet grill. I think that's how you pronounce it. Uh, let me just pop the trunk here. Come on. There you go. Boom. All right. So I'm going to be putting this bad boy on. So this thing came with the car, and... Uh, Looks pretty sick, looks badass. So I'm gonna put it on and uh, I need to wash this car too because this thing's filthy. So yeah, that's all I'm gonna be doing today. So I hope I can take you guys along with me. Um, yeah, let's uh, install this grill. So basically, the only way to take this grill off, I think there's two ways. You could either, you know, take um, the whole front bumper off and uh, nicely remove like the pins that hold it in here or you could do it the other way which i did with my old camaro was uh you yank right here you yank on this side and then there's like pins like right here so then you just pull boom 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 so that's what i'm gonna do um because i, I don't really care for this grill um even if i yank it off i could still put it back on with the side clips those are more than enough to hold it on there's a fucking crow right there. I don't know what he's doing. But anyway, that's what I'm going to do. So sorry if this hurts uh, anybody's feelings, but it's not your car anyway, so I guess it doesn't really matter. And just like that, it's that easy. You just pull these, yank these pins off, these six. And now to uh, screw in that one to there. Okay, well now I'm back doing what I was doing, but I'm um, gonna be screwing it in now So I already got the emblem all fixed up where I want it um, Has those weird little nuts in the back And uh, that's where I'm gonna want it right there on the grill So and then I'm gonna screw it on. It's gonna go right there Kind of like the old-school, you know, Z28s and uh, Yeah so I'm gonna screw those on, and I got these uh, self-tapping screws. I saw some black screws at Walmart where I went, and they looked pretty cool, but I mean, I'll just probably paint the tips of these so that way they're hidden. Then I got my drill, and that's gonna be screwed into this bumper right here. So, uh, yep, we'll see how that goes right now. And just like that, the grill is on, and it looks pretty badass. I just got to color in those uh, screws, but this thing looks sweet. Happy the way it came out. But yeah, I got to color those four screws in. But from, from like this angle, where people would normally be looking at it, looks pretty dope. Badass with those headlights, too. So now that the grill is on... Um, I think it's time to wash her because she needs a car wash pretty badly. So that's what I'm going to go do now. I got some car soap and uh, bought a sponge yesterday. I'm not really good at washing cars. Uh, I do my best, but I think I'm going to take it to one of those. Um, oh, what the hell? There's a cat right there. Hey, kitty. Hi. Hi. What's your name? What's your name? Come here. Aww. It's my neighbor's cat. He'll be in the he'll be in the little video today. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go wash this thing. Um, take it to one of those those dollar places where you put the you get the pressure washer. So yeah, that's what I'm gonna go do. And uh, I'm gonna close the garage before this thing uh, tries to get in there. All right, I'm gonna turn this on. And now to wash my car. All right, rinse this thing out. I got this Walmart soap. Gonna wash my baby with this thing today. It's a big like 100 washes. I, I doubt that's right. I doubt that's accurate, but we'll see. Um, yeah, so uh, let's do this. All right, I'm gonna soap this thing up. Get it all nice and filled with soap and then start going to town. I don't do the two bucket method. Pretty sure I should, but yeah, I'm pretty lazy. My friend Tony knows how to buff, so you know all these swirl marks I'm probably making right now. It's no big deal. 
little buffed out. All right, well, I ended up washing both my dad's and my car, but this thing just looks extremely glossy now. This is beautiful. Oh, I love this car so much. I'm not gonna sell this one. I made that mistake one time, but now I gotta dry off this thing. All right, I hope you guys liked the video. I got my pumpkin spice latte, and uh, the car's looking pretty damn clean. Hopefully you guys were able to see that, but yeah, I think that's it for me. I'm gonna go inside, probably edit this quick little video. Um, but yeah, that shit's hot. But anyway, I hope you guys liked the video. Uh, I'll be making more. Stay tuned and uh, keep on LSing. LSing, that's my new catchphrase. Keep on, keep on LSing. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. I'm just trying to be like TJ Hunt and make like a cool little catchphrase, but. Um, I don't have enough followers or subscribers to do that yet. But keep on LS and that's what I'm going to go for right now. And that's what I'm going to use. So just keep on LS and everybody. Keep on LS. Hashtag.